Hi everyone, I'm in Sacramento right now outside at the ABC 10 studios and it is coming down hard. We are seeing some strong winds too. We felt them all morning. Uh, whoa, you can see there. Uh, winds anywhere from 15 to 20 miles per hour and that rain just pouring down. So we are starting to feel it now. I just looked at our radar. What we're looking at is a long line of rain that's coming through. It just started up in the Bay Area about an hour, hour and a half ago and is hitting hard there all the way to Fairfield. Now we're starting to get some of the rain and this isn't even the heaviest rain so far. So how much puddle here is forming in just a matter of about, I'd say last 30 minutes or so. Kind of hard to tell, but uh, we got some thicker puddles in our studio parking lot. I'm just gonna take you down to this area here. If this isn't indicative of what we're going to see on the roadways, I don't know what else is because we're already starting to see a stream here collecting. And this is only within the last 10, 20 minutes just here in the parking lot. Now we're going to see wet roads all day long. Ooh. Woo. Sorry, I just got to grab this umbrella here. Um, wet roads all day long. This is going to continue until at least... I'd say lunchtime, one o'clock, before we start to see things slow down. You will see sunshine today, so that's a plus uh, for a lot of people, although that's also gonna come with some thunderstorm chances, so just be ready for that. You could see some scattered showers coming in hard by the afternoon, along with thunderstorms and some strong winds. So we're gonna expect this to continue today. This is a major storm system pushing through. It's gonna bring some heavy snowfall across the Sierra. I'm talking here uh, as much as one to two feet of snow. So if you needed to head through the Sierra, uh, you should have already left because uh, it is going to be dangerous there. They're having Caltrans crews uh, closing roadways. We expect that through the afternoon, evening hours as uh, snow piles up. They're gearing up to be ready to close if needed. Otherwise, you really need chains for the day ahead if you're going to head that way. If you can, I'd suggest uh, really just going tomorrow. After Friday morning, snow in the Sierra will slow down and you'll have a nice, beautiful afternoon in the Sierra. And by Saturday and Sunday, your uh, Martin Luther King uh, weekend into Monday, it's going to be gorgeous. You're going to see partly sunny skies, fresh powder for all of you, borders and skiers. So just hold on. We're getting through the storm system right now. Gosh, these winds are so strong. Just trying to hold on to this umbrella here. All right, maybe I can give you a little look at some of the wet roads we're looking at this morning, just getting through here. So we have all of our crews out right now heading out for some of this coverage that we have going on this morning all right so the rain just starting up heavy here in Sacramento if you're just joining us uh, just starting up so we're talking we had a little bit of these lighter showers this morning and now we're looking at some of the heavy rain this will continue at least for the next hour if not hour and a half heavy so I'm talking heavy downpours this is starting to ease up just a little bit I want to show you some of the sky out here so you can see some of the darker shades there and then becoming a little lighter so we're going to continue to see that with winds picking up if you can take a look at what's happening oh these winds are really starting to move this umbrella around uh, you're welcome Anthony yeah stay safe today the roads are gonna be a mess this evening just during the day hopefully everyone is at their destination at work maybe that you can kind of stay there and uh, wait it out until all this rain kind of slows down the winds are gonna be a problem for you this evening too so if you're trying to head home and deal with all the winds and some of the scattered showers just take it easy on the roadways take it slow because that's the most important part is that you make it to your destination trying to avoid accidents I know we're just kind of gearing up and waiting to see what we hear uh, on the roadways what power lines may be out how strong the winds are uh, there was a report of a, of a, a tree on the roadway business 80 which uh, Brittany told me about this morning so Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. occasional gusts here picking up uh, please be careful as you are heading out uh, this is gonna be a dangerous storm system through today and if you are in the foothills listen up for for this because uh, you're gonna get some Sierra snowfall in areas of the foothills I'm talking right around 2,000 feet you could start seeing some sleet that combination of rain and snow kind of a ice pellet look if you will 
a little bit higher at around 2,500 feet, we could start seeing more snow accumulations. And that's where we're looking at a possibility for six inches to even a foot there, much higher reaching as much as two feet of snow at the passes. So uh, Caltrans is gonna try their best, they told us, to clear the roads as much as possible. But if this snow continues very heavy at times and they just can't clear it fast enough, they will close those roads so you don't want to get stuck when they close the roadways of course make sure you have chains and also make sure you have supplies we had zach fuentes out early this morning for morning blend talking to caltrans in the sierra they're saying bring blankets bring food you never know when you're trying to head up there whether or not they're going to decide to just close the roadway altogether and then you're stranded so uh, just make sure you are also prepared Watch out for my umbrella. Thanks, Ron. Yeah, this, this umbrella really starting to shift around um, as the uh, winds pick up. So far, they started slowing down. That's what we're going to see. Those gusts that just pick up out of nowhere, it feels like, and then slow back down. So uh, doing well here this morning. We're just getting through this rain, and hopefully, uh, yeah, looks like I might have to drive home in this rain unless I try to wait it out, too. Everyone be safe. Uh, hopefully, as you're getting off work this evening, you do have a drier commute home, so please be careful in that, too. And those in Stockton, Modesto, you are going to get that rain later on this afternoon, evening. So also, for yourself there, please be careful. I'm watching winds here in the trees starting to shake up here, so... We're in the parking lot. It's hard to see from the distance. Oop, there goes my umbrella. All right, everyone, please be safe and enjoy your holiday weekend. It's going to be a beautiful one here in Northern California, partly sunny, and we'll see temperatures right around those low 50s to mid 50s uh, moving toward Monday. All right, see you later.